fake out. I can't remember. Um, that's a good point, actually. If they do, we can change things up. Um, sorry, we're still chatting on the Discord at the same time. Um, Uh, hold on, because, <laughs> um, right. Yeah, yeah, I think, I think they're not going to expect Doshifu. Well, they are, and it shouldn't matter. Um, we will then bring Corsula, because Corsula can cause chaos to everything there and not really be threatened by it. And I can't decide if it's a Mungus. There's a lot of Psychic out there, so I think, I think Luxray. Yeah, there's too much ice for Thunderous to really do anything this time. Um, Okay, let's see how it goes. Let us see how it goes. Okay, Jinx and Mammoth Swine. So Jinx, oh, okay, so uh, interesting. Okay, okay. So that, actually, that's not, that's not, oh, what do we do here? Um, Cause Melty Tank does a lot. Um, I think they've done the sensible thing, but by not, I just can't remember if, if somebody has flinch or not. I guess we're gonna find out if they flinch. Hey oh, welcome. Um, we're sort of uh, what do we do here? What do we do, what do we do? Um, I think we just do this. I think we just go on the offensive. Um, I can't remember, I was trying to remember if Jinx has fake out or not. Um, but I think we just, we just hit things uh, and see how it goes. Um, yeah, Jinx has fake out. Okay, so now we know at least. They've gone into Urshifu, which isn't the end of the world, really. Oh, Sil Valley! And that's why, and that's, well, I mean, I knew there was going to be ice, um, but that's, that's cool. That's worked well. Um, a better start than I was expecting. I didn't think it would one-shot it, but I suppose it's, um, it's four times weak, isn't it, to steal? Yeah, <laughs> I was like, what? That was unexpected. Okay. Now this is where we get to play my trick. I don't know, do I do the trick straight away? I have a trick for Hatterene. Um, I don't know if I want to pull it straight out of the bag though. multi attack is still going to do big damage to it. Oh, I can't decide, I can't decide, I can't decide. Um, No, I think we'll do it. And we Wicked Blow into Jinx, because I think the, the sensible play here is to max. No. Okay. I hate Lovely Kiss. <laughs> hate, hate, hate Lovely Kiss. Um, but getting Jinx off the park is gonna be useful, and then it's, unless it's sashed. Good to know if it is sashed. It's sashed, okay, so the sash is on the Jinx. And now we're going to lose um, hat. Although we've got, um, we've got a spray move coming out. This is just going to bounce off Sil Valley. Um, yeah, I mean, it was always likely that it was going to be sashed. Um, but you never know. You never know. I think we now keep Corsula. Well, yeah, we lose attack by doing this because I'm, I'm, I'm presuming it's magic bounce. Um, yeah, I, you know, I think we'll just do this. Um, I think we just do this. Oh, it's not Magic Bounce. Okay. That's a surprise. That is a, that is a big, big surprise. Um, okay. Well, that changes a, a heck of a lot. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm really thrown by that. So my, my whole strategy was to parting shot and bounce out. Oh, I can't say this is going to get annoying. <laughs> um, was to parting shot and bounce out the Hatterene. Um, but, 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 um, Mystical Fire is a clever move. 
And it is gonna. Oh, it doesn't quite knock it out. Yeah, so we're in a tight spot here. This is a tight spot. So I don't think we have much choice. We have to hit. Um, and we have to snarl. Because we, now, we, now we know we can snarl. Um, which again was unexpected. So I think we're going to have to just use. Um, okay, so we're going to probably. Yeah, obviously it's not not effective on Silver Alley. Dazzling Gleam is going to take it out. Um, oh, can you get? A, can you knock it out? Your attack's not been dropped. Ah, that was necessary. God damn, that was necessary. Would have been helpful you doing something, Lux. So what's in the back now? Um, yeah, I mean, Sil Valley is just just hammering stuff today. Um, Glastria. Okay, okay. Um, so, slow. Jinx doesn't really have a choice here. And they can't get... Yeah, I mean, it's got a max... Uh, and yeah, it's, uh, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Um, I think we parting shot it because they've got nothing in the back. Luxray surely wakes up this turn. So he might be put to sleep, and if he's put to sleep, so be it. Um, ah! Serves you right. <laughs> Why aren't they maxing, though? Why aren't they maxing? Okay, so Corsola comes out, and there's not a huge amount that's going to happen to Corsola. Um, yeah, I know. What's what, like? What's going on? These are some strange choices. I mean, Corsola. Ah, oh, there's okay. Cool. There's the snarl. Um, and now, what do we do? <laughs> what do we do against Glastriot? Because oh, the, you know, this this um, <laughs> this could now take its time. Yeah, that's not going to do much. Okay, so now it's faster. Um, okay. <laughs> what do we do? I think... Yeah, I mean, I mean that's... That's all, all we can do. I think we're just going to keep lowering its attack. Um, I guess we wild charge it. Because with... with Sylvania in the back is going to hurt it at some point. Um, I, I suppose I should have switched um, switch out the um, what do you call it the, um, the luxury to get the extra drop. That would have made more sense. Um, anyway, it's minus one. Defense on Corsler is minus one as well. But that sort of bounces out. A paralysis would be nice. A little bonus paralysis. No. Okay, so hail comes into into the luxury. Okay. That's not going to do much. So I think we... Uh, as long and drawn out as this is going to be, I think we just keep doing it. Because... Um, why, why wouldn't you? Yeah, okay, so he's... Yeah, I think we just have to do that. Yeah, I mean, I'm guessing Glastria is like max max health or something. Um, but I think we just... We sacrifice Sylv Alley. We'll get the attack drop. Um, it is a very thick horse. So in my other draft league um, that I'll be playing on Saturday morning, I'm running with both Glastria and Calyrex Ice Rider. Um, I'm only allowed to max uh, the Glastria, <laughs> but I'm bringing both by both ice horses. Um, I'm not sure how well that's going to work for me, but I, I just you know I couldn't resist. It was it was too good not to. Okay, so that sort of makes sense. Um, I suppose the question is, you know, who, who do I max in all this? Um, I suppose it's just gonna have to be. Um, Oh yeah, well, I, yeah, I think it's definitely the better option, um, and I, I think Calyrex Ice um, because of its spread move. I think I think you just want to make sure you you, you keep that out. Um, but yeah, um, I mean, I, I, in that draft league, we don't have a choice. Um, 
So uh, Calyrex Ice is in sort of a tier that's uh, banned from uh, maxing. Um, okay, we'll do this one more time. Um, yeah, I think just for good measure. Because um, we're not going to max the, the course of it, surely. <laughs> it's, um, but yeah, no, um, I think the problem that I've got is the first matchup that I'm playing against is a Sun team. Um, so they've, they've got ground on, which, which is fine, because ground on struggles with all the ice that we've got. Um, but they do have uh, G Max Charizard, uh, <laughs> which could just one shot my entire team. Um, but it could be fun. I think, I think Saturday will be fun. I have, I have low expectations for Saturday, um, but it should work out well. For, the, for game two in this, I'm kind of. I don't know if anyone has um, knockoff. If they don't have knockoff, Corsola is um, quite comfortable in this one. Um, which again is good. I suppose the question as well is do we do we use detect on Urshifu um, in that first turn? Um, anyway, now we can just start chipping. Sorry everyone, this could this could take its time. Um, <laughs> because neither of these things can hit Glastro particularly hard. Boo! Go on, we gotta get through this one. It's gonna take forever. Look at that. Look at it just bouncing off of it. That's ridiculous. So leg one is finishing with nothing that can hurt Glastra and Glastra can't hurt anything <laughs> that's out there. We'll get there. We'll get there in the end. How long has this bad battle been going on for so far? Yeah, this, this could take its time. Imagine if I had Porygon 2 in this as well. You know, and, um, I've played very few uh, ranked battles this this month just because I haven't had time. Um, but but I'm, I'm running uh, P2 and Dialga in that team, and I've had uh, uh, oh oh that was that was better. Okay, a Nightshade could just take it out now. Um, yeah. Okay. Cool. Hey, Corsola gets the knockout. Okay, so that's game one. That was quicker than I anticipated. I, I, I missed. I don't think there was a crit in there. It was just. Um, it was just a really big hit, um, uh, so that's cool. Yeah, yeah, um, I was pleased with that. Um, okay, so if I was them, I'd be doing Jinx stuff now. Um, so, I don't know, Jinx worked really well for them and could have caused a big problem. So I'm wondering if we redirect um, and just go max um, Max on the first turn, and just set up electric terrain. I don't know if that's the right decision. We get a we get an attack drop straight away. I I kind of like this. Amoongus is going to die, but if anything hits it, it's got Rocky Helm and it's got Effect Ball. Um, I am tempted by that, and maybe. Urshifu seems an obvious, uh, but if they bring um, Dusclops, then this really struggles. Oh, what to do, what to do. Um, if I was them, I'd lead Jinx again, because Jinx was so useful. Um, yeah, I'm going to gamble. I'm going to gamble and not bring Urshifu this time. I think I've brought Urshifu to every leg of this competition so far, which makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Because <laughs> it's Urshifu. Um, so we're just having a chat with Tokyo Terrors here. All right, where are they at? <laughs> yeah, it, it's always seemed, for for a game that's supposed to be set in Britain. Um, I thought it was such a weird um, addition to the game, a very cool addition, uh, but makes no sense. You know, that great history of uh, of martial art fighting bears in Britain. <laughs> okay, let's see how we go. Game two is leaving Urshifu behind. A really, really silly mistake. You watch, it'll be Dusclops and Hatterene this time. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. What have we got? No, no, Jinx and Hatterene. Okay, so. Ah, 
No, I, I, th I still think we do this because it makes it makes more sense too. Um, that's sort of by the by. <sighs> yeah, I mean it, it's so that makes most sense. Um, so I think fake out, then trick room. And so, <sighs> question: Who who do they fake out? If they don't fake out the Amoongus, um, ah, oh, this is annoying. I'm just wondering if you want to, or if we double in. Yeah, probably. If they make a mistake, though, I think we, I think we just do that to get the terrain, um, because it's going to be G Max, um. They could make a mistake and go into Lux. It's possible. Unlikely, but possible. Um, we know that Lux Ray can still hit pretty hard, um, which is useful. Um, I'd rather not be struggling with sleep from Jinx. Um, yeah, okay. So yeah. That was always likely. Hey! Who would have thought it? That's hilarious. And the chip damage. <laughs> now, can we get... Can, no, I wasn't going to one-shot it, was it? But, yeah, that's, it's beautiful that that's happened. Um, so now, so, I mean, now it puts pressure on, because... Mystical fire? What? What? That's crazy. What'd they do that for? What? I and now can Moon just take out Hatterene? I think we I think we just try that because and spread this damage around and just go max darkness. That's crazy. Yeah. Okay, guys, kill everything. What? What just happened there? This has been such a weird set. <laughs> what? Yeah, I'm not gonna question it. That was just... Yeah, I mean, it probably doesn't, but... Um... But still, yeah, but it might... It might... Uh... Let's see... Okay, so Jinx is still alive, which, um... That's a bit of a surprise. And that was a critical hit as well! Okay. Anyway, so special defense is down, and this is what I wonder if it's gonna play into, um... Oh no, it's faster! Okay, this is a very weird Hatterene. Very, very weird Hatterene. Um, okay, I'm so confused. It's fast. It's a fast Hatterene that doesn't have magic bounce. What is going on? Oh, I'm so thrown by this team. It's like one of those ones where you're thinking like, it's, it's, is this really big brained? Or, or is it? I, I, I'm I so thrown. Um, yeah, I, okay, okay, I think we just kill things then. Um, I'm guessing. I mean, they, they've been doing weird stuff, so maybe we get another drop on Hatterene in case they max, and... Um, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Magmorta! I love Magmorta, and it's a shiny! Brilliant. Fair play, that's a great play. That was a brilliant play, well done. This isn't gonna do anything. Oh, I, cry I tell you what. Ah, the burn. The burn is bad. The burn is bad. Okay, so what we do have is speed. And I can still snarl it, okay. So it's not it's not as bad as it might have been. Um, the burn hurts, um, but but we can still do things against um, Magmorta. So this should be the end of Max for us, which is actually a really good thing. Um, we want this to be over. I'm get surely Sil Valley outspeeds Magmorta, so I think we we want to double in on the hat in case now it goes for Trick Room. Um, 
and we know it doesn't have magic bounce. What does more damage? Harshly lowers. Yeah, okay, so we do that to the Magmortar, because the Magmortar's special, um, and we just want to start... Ah! <laughs> what? I'm just so confused. I'm so confused. Okay, Hatterene's dead. And, okay, so they get, they, they get one turn of Helping Hand. Oh, crap, that went... F he did go first. Wow. Okay. Okay, well, at least Helping Hand is gone, which is something. And we're dropping by two. So that's... that's something by, wow, yeah. Could be scuffed. Yeah, you're right. Could well be. Um, so it makes the last turn really interesting. It makes the game much longer than I thought it might be. Ah, yeah, he's, he's thrown me on this one. So Glastory comes out. Um, and they're probably going to max, I'm guessing. So we just we just start doing the same thing. And I don't think we have much choice here. I think we have to just keep getting the drops on the Magmortar. Um, okay. So Michael's really cagey on. Um, oh, nice, nice. It was a clever play, um, but because we've got that drop in already, um, that is going to start causing problems. Jeez, we could be in for a very, very long second set now. <laughs> okay. So we know it's not scarfed. Yeah, yeah. It's um. So that sort of surprises me. Okay. Luxray isn't going to survive this next turn. Because um, it would make sense for them to double up. So we just Snarl, I think. Yeah, I'm, it's... In fairness, I don't know if this is by design um, or accident, but it's, 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 it's like a really, really fast Trick Room team. It's like it's got all the making is a Trick Room without a Trick Room. Which is either accidental or, or genius. Somewhere between the two. Jeez. Okay. Ah! Policy! Policy! Okay, so like, like, if it goes to a third game, at least we know where it is. And course was burned! Ah! Okay, um... On the glass, yeah, okay. It's a decent chip. Can Corsola survive the hit if it comes in? Okay, so it's not coming in, but yeah, I mean, this is a really good play. Um, really impressed by it. So it's now like plus three on the Corsola. Um, I have no idea if Corsola can survive. It'll be an interesting um, experiment. I've <laughs> actually got an appointment at like half past one, so I'm, I, <laughs> I can't, can't, we've got to move this on. Okay, so. That takes it just to back to plus two, and they can't they can't get any more boosts, okay? Which is something. The mag is pretty knackered. Um, we don't have a choice on this. We just have to keep doing this. Um, sorry, guys. This this could could be a long one. Depends what um, moves they got in the bag. Um, so it's watching. I can't be burnt again. So that's something. So Max Hail. Oh yeah, no surviving that. Fair play, what a, that just completely threw me all over the place. Massive final hit. Epic stuff, yeah, GG's indeed. That was cool. Okay, <laughs> we gotta play this third leg quickly because this is, um. It's taking too long. Uh, yeah, play the same rules. Yeah, what do we do there? Because that was um, really impressive stuff. Um, so obviously that worked really well for them. Um, what do we do against that? Because Ice Horse was um, was epic. I just suppose this is the, the turn where they come out with Trick Room now. Um, entirely possible. I mean, fair play, that, that was like... Yeah, Corsal does get Haze. Um, it's a good point, actually. Um, I suppose we, we just didn't get a chance to um, 
uh, get the uh, get the haze off. I think we know the Corsal is the slowest thing out there as well now. Um, so, Jinx, I, Jinx still puts pressure on. Um, you know, there's, there's very little that we can do about that. Um, and it, it's, it's sort of the pairing that, that had worrying me. If, you know, it's, it's that thing. If we could um, magic bounce um, Hatterene out, this would work really well, but not having magic bounce. Um, again, I'd love to know if that's by design, because it was really, really, really smart stuff. Um, okay. What do we do here? What do we do? I think we still have to do that. Um, but if he leads with Mag... <laughs> well, I think if he leads with Mag, we're kind of screwed either way. Um, Lux has been really good. Unless, unless, unless. I'll take inspiration on this one <laughs> because the gamble is saying um, the lovely kiss misses. Um, oh, I'm running out of time. Okay, I think not having Lux rate may be a mistake, but I think we missed out on the power. Um, not bringing Urshifu means we miss out on a lot of uh, potential power. Um, so that that's the tricky element um, and so we're sacrificing terrain but who knows maybe they don't go for that um, so we're looking for redirection and okay same sort of thing okay um, right so redirect to begin with that's that's the the first thing so powder and have to go multi-attack. They could just switch out again if it's the same play. Um, but we, we did see that we could do pretty decent damage. Um, oh god, what am I even thinking? Of course it goes first. I'm such a... Uh, that's my brain failing. You know what that is? That is not... Um, and there's the trick. Okay. Okay, you know what? Um... You're not Magic Bounce, are you? So... Yeah, I think... We know... Earlier, like, Hatterene definitely outsped Amoongus, yeah. So Amoongus has to be able to get this in. They don't have Magic Bounce. What? What? Hello. I'm confused. I'm very, very confused, guys. I'm super confused. That, that, you guys all saw this, right? Hatterene was not Magic Bounce earlier, okay? And now it is Magic Bounce. Um... Really? I, I always thought that Magic Bounce would bounce back, um... Probably bounce the entire time. Jeez, okay. Right, well that's... That's... A problem. Just status. Okay, okay. Ah! Oh, I made a mess of this final one, haven't I? Okay, so I have to Rage Powder. And... Now we'll do it. <laughs> course well I suppose we've learned something from this game if nothing else I've misread um, the way this move works oh. I'm a clown <laughs> it drops the attack on the Mingus <laughs> Yeah, see, you know, I sort of built this team just to do that. <laughs> and it's, and it was probably not not a very smart thing to do, but um, 
And Amoongus avoids. Okay. <laughs> oh, David, you're doing some silly things today. All right. Tell you what, let's let's kill the Jinx. <laughs> yeah. See, that's that's the thing. I I thought they'd be doing like um a major um hattering trick room thing, and that they'd be maxing hat. Um, and I really wanted just a max um hattering out like a bounce hattering out the game with its own ability. Um, we obviously haven't had the opportunity to do that. Um, but yeah, I, I might have got a little bit too obsessed with just trying to do that with this game, but actually play it properly. Um, so that, that was silly on my part, but I think worth it. I think worth it. Um, okay, so what do we do now? We can't put the Hatterene to sleep. Um, Glastria is asleep, but it's still policy. Um, so what do we do here? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Um, so we can I just don't because so, it's going to have mystical fire um, I suppose we could protect um, or parting shot again <laughs> what do we do or 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 let's bring Corsler in Yeah, I just think I want I want slow pressure to come in. So if Glastria does stay asleep, we can start doing things to it. Um, yeah, it's not going to do much um, to the hat, and we pr yeah we probably lose. Oh no, okay, that, that's that, that's fine. That's that is not a problem. Yeah, I mean it's okay. Another turn of sleep, so that's that's useful. Um, what do we do here? What do we do? What do we do? <laughs> I think Oshiri just has to sort of hang around and hope for the best. Um, yeah, I'm not sure, and I think my, my screen is sort of in the way of this. Um, no, no. Yeah, no, 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 yeah, so Trick Room... Uh, fell last turn um, okay I think we just keep doing that they yeah I'm probably overthinking things um, yeah Glastria wakes up and Icicle crashes the Amoongus um, so they'll get a boost here um, I just I think if they do Question if that mag is out there. And if they go for Trick Room again. If they do go for Trick Room again. Um, <laughs> there we go. Okay, there's Trick Room. Again. So uh, I still think Corsola is the the slowest thing out there. Um, so I think we just keep looking to chip away at the um, at the strength of Lastrit. So we protect, he could switch um, here actually. <sighs> yeah, I, I don't think we have a choice. Because he can, he can just undo that. I'll tell you what, what we can do. Um, no, 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 that'll be silly. That, that, that's my fun, silly play. I think we just do this. <laughs> yeah, because I figured this might happen. Um, but who is it? Who is it? Who's who's coming? Go for the horse. Do the horse. Yeah. Okay. So we just want to keep dropping the horse now. Oh crap. So I actually got an appointment in 20 minutes, um, at which point I had to leave either way. Um, so Glastria, who's it going to come in on? I can't remember, have we dropped it all once already? Can't remember now. So knuckle in, so yeah, okay, that makes sense. Oh, he survives it, well done. Okay, that's really useful. Um, 
that is useful. So I think we just keep doing that. I don't think I have much choice. Um, yeah, I'm not going to bother double protecting. He dies either way. Um, and we just keep doing that. So there's the hail, um, but we, oh actually that did a lot of damage, a lot, a lot of damage. Um, <laughs> yeah, now it's, now, now it's speeding up, that's bad, we don't want to be speeding up. Speeding up is a, is a, is a problem. Ah, uh, that might actually lose it, that did way more damage than I thought it would. Um, And there's Urshfu. And because of the goddamn sash, you can't really do much here. Um, Cause yeah, they just they just go for the spread move here. Um, yeah, we don't have a choice. Ah, damn, that's really annoying. Okay guys, that might have lost it. Um, God, that second game was was epic. Um, the play that they came out with was huge. Um, I do just worry that um, Corsa was now going to be too fast because of weak armor. And it wasn't it wasn't the actual ability that I wanted to put on it. I just sort of ran out of time. Yeah, that that did one. That, that one definitely. Um, I think probably makes the difference. Um, the only thing is if they go greedy into. Um, um, Urshifu, but seems unlikely. They got greedy. They got greedy. Michael got greedy. There's an outside chance now. There is a chance. Okay, <laughs> yeah, where well, there's life, well, there's a way. Uh, okay, so we're still trick room, I'm, I'm guessing. My face is in the way, so I can't see. Um, I don't think we have much choice. I think we just have, yeah, do we do that or do we do it into the hat? I think we go into the hat. Um, Yeah, I agree. Um, at this stage, it's more threatening. Um, okay. Let me try that. There we go, set, guys. Um, okay. So, I was wor worried that that might be my delivery, and I switched it out. Oh, God, this is going to take so much time! Damn it! Hiya! Hey! Yeah, that that might be the game. Um, sorry, guys, that um, that is my daughter asking for, my, for some assistance. Um, yeah, I think this has been such a good game, and my yeah, I, I definitely. Um, I think we just, I think we'll just um, spread the damage because I do have. I'm so sorry because I got another appointment that's starting, so I'm actually going to start getting dressed to to, to go out for it. Um, but yeah, that is an amazing game. Um, they did so well. We could just kind of drag it out, but I think we just... Um, I think we're not, we're not going to turn it around from there. God, look at, look at how much damage Corsola is doing. That is crazy. Um, come on, Michael. Let's finish this. <laughs> um, but yeah, an epic set. Uh, Michael really... Uh, I mean just completely outplay me. Now we could, do we take out the hat? No, 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 we, we, we can't, they're gonna outspeed us. Um, but that would be the logical play. Keys. 
<laughs> Sorry, this game went on for so long. Uh, so it almost worked. If we, I, I think I messed up on, my, on that magic bounce read in terms of what magic bounce actually does. Um, yeah, that's the play. <laughs> yeah, I was just on the message. Okay, guys, cool. That was epic. Thank you so much to everyone who watched. I'm sorry I couldn't give you a win uh, for this one, but that was a lot of fun. Some crazy stuff going on. Um, but yeah, I've really got to go and do some real life work now. Um, so we will, uh, yeah, yeah, we'll stop there. Thank you so much, guys. Um, uh, we are playing again on Saturday, um, different league, and we might uh, try and fit in some more games on this. Yeah, cool. Um, all right, guys, I got to go do some work, so we'll see you later on. Thanks, guys. We'll see you soon.